Manchester City, backed back champions, first male team ever to win the English domestic treble and criticised by their rivals due to having rich owners. But the journey they have been on is much, much richer. Main Road was built by Sir Robert McAlpine, who also built Wembley Stadium. Main Road opened in 1923 after Manchester City moved from Hyde Road Stadium with Horace Barnes scoring the first ever goal at Main Road in a 2-1 win over Sheffield United. It still holds the record attendance of a game outside of Wembley with an attendance of 84,569 when Manchester City beat Stoke City 1-0 in the FA Cup in 1934. Even though Main Road was, you know, historically and always will be the, the high uh, attendance in English football. Stanley Stadium. You know, you always get better atmospheres in them grounds. In 1992, the FA Premier League was formed and Manchester City versus QPR was the first ever live Monday night Sky game. Manchester City lost their last ever game at Main Road 1-0 to Southampton in the Premier League on the 11th of May 2003, with Michael Svensson scoring the decisive goal. Main Road was closed and demolished in 2003. In 1999, after a huge drop off the standards made by the greats like Mike Summerby and Colin Bell, Manchester City found themselves battling in the playoff finals against Gillingham to find their way back into the second tier of English football. Manchester City found themselves 2-0 down in the 87th minute after goals from Carlos Arba and Robert Taylor. I thought at the time we'd walk that match, no problem. Kevin Horlock scored in the 90th minute with Paul Dickoff scoring the now famous goal to equalise in the 95th minute to send the game to extra time. Honest opinion, we wouldn't be where we are nowadays with everything we've got had that not had happened the way that it did. It is an extra time. Nicky Weaver saving the penalty, his celebration around the pitch turns players like that into club legends. In 2008, the owner of the Abu Dhabi United group, Sheikh Mansour, became the new owner of Manchester City. And Manchester City go on to break the British transfer record for the second time with the 32.5 million signing of Rubinho from Real Madrid.